There are two ways to say numbers in Korean. In the native Korean way, numbers from 1 to 5 is read 하나, 둘, 셋, 넷, 다섯. 6 through 10 is read 여섯, 일곱, 여덟, 아홉, 열. When numbers 1 to 4, 하나, 둘, 셋, 넷 is used with counters, it is changed to 한, 두, 세, 네. For example, one person is 한 명 instead of 하나. Sino-Korean numbers are based on Chinese characters, and numbers 1 through 5 are read 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6 through 10 is 6, 7, 8. Ship. Now let's go over numbers in tens and hundreds. Twenty is Sumul, thirty is Sudden, forty is Mahun, fifty is Shin, sixty is Yesun in native Korean, seventy is Idun, eighty is Yadun, ninety is Ahun, a hundred thousand and 10,000 in native Korean are rarely used nowadays. Sino-Korean number 10 is ship. For 20, it's e ship, which literally means 210. 30 is some ship, which is 310. 40 is sa ship. 50 is o ship. 60 is yuk ship. 70 is chi ship. 80 is pal ship. 90 is ku ship. A hundred is peg, a thousand is chun, and ten thousand is man. Now let's try a couple of examples. Eleven in native Korean is yorana. Eleven in Sino Korean is ship il. Twenty one in native Korean is sumul hana. Twenty one in Sino Korean is yi ship il. One hundred twenty one in native Korean is peg. Sumulhana in Sino Korean is Pek Yi Ship Il. 5121 in native Korean is Ochon Pek Sumulhana in Sino Korean is Ochon Pek Yi Ship Il. You notice the 5000 and 100 is both Sino Korean. 95121 in native Korean is Kuman Ochon Pek Sumulhana. In Sino Korean, it is 95,121. To say someone's age in Korean, 살 or 세 is added to the number. They both mean age. The only difference is 살 is a native Korean word, 세 is a Sino Korean word. Native Korean numeric term is more conversational than the Sino-Korean term. Let's go over a few examples. Age of 7 is 일곱 살 in Native Korean and 칠세 in Sino-Korean. 25 years old is 스물다섯 살 in Native Korean and 이십오세 in Sino-Korean. 36 years old is 서른여섯 살 in Native Korean and 36세 in Sino-Korean. 39 years old is 39 살 in Native Korean and 39세 in Sino-Korean. 37이요. 나랑 두살 차이? 아, 그럼 39. 누구야? 그럼... 응. 저거 한살 나이만 한 살이지. 회사 짬밥으로는 인연이거든. 54 years old is 신네 살 in native Korean and 54 세 in Sino Korean. To say a time in Korean, you have to follow this rule. Native Korean numbers must be used for hours, and Sino Korean numbers must be used for minutes and seconds. Let's try some examples. 1 o'clock is 1시, 2.30 is 2시 30분, 
4.55 is 4시 55분. 11.47 is 11시 47분. 9 hours 38 minutes and 27 seconds is 9시 38분 27초. 지금 새벽 1시인데 갑자기 무슨... 그럼 왕복 4시간이야? 밥 먹는 거예요? 밤 9시가 넘었는데? 밤 10시가 넘어야 편의점이 오나요? 그쵸, 그때 학원들이 끝나니까. 어, 10분 후에 예약 있어. A half is pan and can also be used instead of 30 minutes, 30분. It is more common to use Sino-Korean numeric terms for dates. The order to put dates in Korean is a year first, followed by a month and a day. Let's review a few examples. Year 2022 is 2022년. 년 is a Sino-Korean word for a year. October is 10월. 월 is a Sino-Korean word for a month. 10 is 10. But instead of saying 10월, it is said 10월 for a better flow of sound. 15th day is 15일. 일 is a word for a day. Let's try to say a complete date. October 15th, 2022 is read 2022년 10월 15일. December 31st, 2023 is read 2023년 12월 31일. 일단 6월 2일 오전 10시부터 오후 4시까지. 25년 했으면 이제 그만해도 되잖아. 그게 벌써 25년이나 됐나. For counts, native Korean numeric term is more commonly used, but there are always some exceptions. Also, there are different counters that need to match the type of objects that are being counted. These are some of the counters used every day. There are many more counters than what are listed here. For a small object or general objects that do not have a specific counter, we use 개 or 가지. You can say 한개 주세요 or 한 가지 주세요 when asking for one object. 아이스 아메리카노에 샷두 개랑 바닐라 시럽 두번 추가해 주세요. 한 가지만 더. 장 is a counter for anything made of paper or something as thin as a paper. 선생님 두장 주셨네요? 저 어제 같은 밤두 장, 아니다 세장 주세요. 네, 잠시만요. 네. 잔 is a counter for a glass or a cup. 딱한 잔만 더. 아메리카노는 세잔 주시겠어요? Counter for animal or creature is 마리. When we say 네 마리, lower consonant shield is dropped from net for a better flow of sound. For location or places, counter 군대 is used. 다섯 군대 갔어요 means I went to five places. There are many counters for people. 사람 is a native Korean word for human. 명 is a Sino-Korean word. 분 is an honorific counter. When you go to a restaurant, you're asked how many parties. In Korean, it is said 몇 분이세요? 2년차 2명, 1년차 3명. 물론 한 명은 종로 일제로 갔지만 그래도 네 명이 어디예요? Counter for a tree is 그루, and a flower is 송이. 나무 아홉 그루 means nine trees. Ten stems of rose is said 장미 열 송이 in Korean. Listed here are examples of counters that are used with Sino-Korean numbers. Floor is 층. 삼층 means either third floor or three stories depending on the context. 어디로 가요? 저 카페 3층이요. 몇층 가세요? 어, 12층이요. 학년 is for a school grade. 3학년 means third grade. 한티 중학교 3학년이죠. A serving is 인분. When you order food in a restaurant, now you can say 1인분 주세요 to get one serving. Percentage is said in two ways. Puro or percent are both commonly used. Among young people, it is a new trend to shorten percent for per. 
성적평가는 판결 분석문 50%, 시험 50%. 100%. 진짜? 진짜로? 교수님이? 100%. 진짜로. When you say month in terms of duration or a period of time, 개월 is an appropriate counter to use. 6개월 refers to a period of 6 months. 6월 is a sixth month of the year, which is used for a date. 6개월, 1년, 2년. 나 유급휴가 받았어? 6개월. For ordinal numbers, native Korean numeric term is more commonly used, but there are always some exceptions. To make ordinal numbers, J is added to the native Korean number. 첫째, 둘째, 셋째 means first, second, and third. J is added to the Sino Korean numbers to make ordinal numbers. It goes 제일, 제이, 제삼. 사장님의 선택지는 두 가지입니다. 첫째, 아니면 둘째. Counter 번째 is used for rank or occurrence. 첫 번째 can mean first time or first place depending on the context. 세 번째죠? 네 번째예요. 등 is another counter for rank, but this one is paired with Sino-Korean number. 1등 means the first place in the ranking. 어, 내가 1등 하고 현식 너 2등 그리고 세림이 너 3등 이렇게. 번 is another counter for occurrence. 한번 means one time. This is cardinal number and don't get mixed with ordinal number 첫 번째, which is first time. 딱한 번만이라도 잘했던 소리 듣는 게 소원이었는데. Counter pun is also paired with Sino-Korean number to refer to a specific number. For example, your locker number can be 1번, your phone extension is 15번, ticket number is 7번, and 5th Avenue is 5번가. This is the end of the Korean numeric system explained. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos to come.